have Noah and um, I have all the babies. So I plan on getting back into the nursery today and we're just going to do a full family video. So as you guys know, I did upload a Barbie video, but today I'm hanging out with the boys this morning and I have little baby Noah. I have my special needs baby. He... He is so adorable, you guys. And look, I even changed his shorts. He's wearing Nike. And then he has his little Dr. Seuss shirt he's wearing. Oh, the places we'll go. So, yes. Because he will go places. Noah's going to go places. Liam is just hanging out. I'm probably going to get Liam a toy so he's not bored. They love his little rattle, colorful rattle thing. And it keeps them occupied. Here I go, Lily. That's what we call Liam for short. Is that fun? Is that fun, little Lily? You want to hold on to it? Liam is so teething. Um. Yeah, he's still teething. And he's just... Liam's just having fun with his little toys. Yeah, that's Lily. So I'm gonna turn the camera. Are you curious in Liam's toy? Cause it's colorful. You gotta wait your turn, buddy. You you love playing with that toy too. I know all the boys they love playing with that baby toy. It's just cause it's colorful and it's just entertaining. Cause it rattles. No, we don't no don't take his toy. Not you gotta share toys, Noah. I know you're you really you're really curious in his toy because you want the toy. Look, there's so many other toys. Do you want to play with another toy? What about this keyboard? Okay, let me take this off. We can play with another toy. Look at this toy. It's Jeffy's cat piano, but it's also a baby piano, so. Do you want to play with it? Yeah. Are you curious in the buttons? Hello, take your hand. What? <laughs> oh, you just hit the. Do you want to play with your foot? He's literally turning up the volume. He's playing with the volume with his to with his foot. You want to touch it with your foot? Does it make a sound? You're very curious. You're very curious in the toy. I don't want to do that. I don't think we should play the piano that way. Is, does the keys look fun? Here, let's press the key. That's pretty cool. Sorry, there's hair all over. Okay, maybe we don't want to play with that toy. So Noah's playing with his toy. I do gotta show you something. So I organized and folded all their clothes. Because their clothes are getting a little messy. And some of the older boys, they just throw up, toss the clothes back in their dresser. So this is all of Liam's swimming suits. And like the big, huge to toddler and dolls um, swim, swim trunks. And then this is like my other boys' clothes. And... Um, with Jeffy, some trunks, and Charlie. Like, there's still a lot more because I have a lot of them. And then, these are all their shirts. So there is onesies, they have long sleeve shirt, and it's since I needed to put the long sleeve shirts where they're going to be, it's since it's fall, and it's starting to get a little cooler outside. So, that's why I put that there. And then I put their pants where I can get them because after fall it's going to be winter and it's going to start getting cooler. So I have the pants where I need them to be and then the baby's pants right here. 
So these are all the boys' clothes. And I got this dresser for my Grammy because unfortunately my Grammy passed away. So I'm now using this dresser. And then down there is just, I think, oh, pajamas. These are just pajamas. And then a whole bunch of their shoes, like little sandals, lamb shoes, just tennis shoes and stuff that I use for them. And that's pajamas. So all their shorts and pants and clothes and shirts are folded and stuff. So I folded their clothes. I just needed to put the pants here because, again, it's starting to get cooler outside and they're soon they're going to need pants to wear while they're out. And then... I also need to figure out a place to put the jackets because these are like winter jackets. Like this is Noah's jacket I got um, uh, from a garage sale and it has a little moose on it. I do like to go shopping at stores for some of the Reborns clothes like Walmart, Target or Kohl's or any other store. But I decided to get this at a garage sale because garage sale and um, thrift stores, you can find a whole bunch of things that are, you know, discounts and stuff that are cheaper. So this is um, Noah's little jacket. He's going to wear this fall and this winter. And then this is, um, this right here. And then this is, um, just another jacket for, like, um, Micah and the smaller babies. And then this is... I'm gonna other jacket for like Garrett. So Garrett will probably need a jacket this winter and it has a little hoodie and it even zips up like that. So he is definitely gonna use this this fall and winter. And then of course, the bigger jacket, I think we all know this is Liam's jacket that he came with um, with all his clothes. So this is his winter jacket, but I had for when I first got Liam so this is his winter jacket because it's big because he is a huge toddler and um knocking down everything maybe that's not a safe idea to put this right here and that's what he Liam will wear this winter and I, I like it how it has zippers and they make him extra warm. He also has um, a zip up zipper and then he has buttons on his jacket. Um, yeah, that's his jacket. It has a little hoodie for Liam so I can put it up when he's going to daycare. He's not actually in daycare today because we, I, we have nowhere to go. So, yeah. Um, my dad has to go um, somewhere Thursday, every Thursday, just somewhere, and then Liam and the babies will go to daycare, or someone may come with me, so this is just a jacket for Liam. One thing I have to show you, this is Lee, Liam's car seat. I probably will bring it out with my rec therapist at some point. This is Liam's car seat. I got to show you something cool. There was one cup holder. It was not to understand why babies need two cup holders. Maybe to keep a little snack in, and then one right here that you open up right here for a drink so i don't know maybe something like that i don't know why this car seat has two cup holders on the side maybe to make it extra fancier or maybe they need two drinks i don't know this is his graco like little booster seat it's not a car seat but it's a booster seat i keep trying to get my dad to get me a car seat because he's like no not, you don't need a gigantic car seat because that won't fit in his car but I, I want it for fun, you know. It's interesting. And this is Lily's car seat. I put it over here with the shoulder. I mean, probably the perfect spot for it because, I mean, like, the shoulder's for out, like, when I, if I want to go on a walk. And then this is um, um, Liam's little Graco car seat. Graco, I don't know, something like that. That's his dinosaur car seat, and he loves sitting in it. Now I need to make my bed, because I'll look at that. It's a mess. Um, those are my two girls. They, what are you doing, Natalie? What are you doing, Abby? They're just hanging out in the bed. I guess they're just chilling. But I do need to make my bed. 
And this is a little behind scenes. I'm probably just going to organize, like, straighten out my Barbies and stuff. And this is the dad that belongs in this house. So this is the behind the scenes of the house. I think I showed you guys in one of the videos. That's the behind the scenes of the house that, um, that I, ha um, play in. So, yeah. So that's my house, my doll house. My house. And those are the mom's kids. And Bella actually got a new room. So she'll be giving you a room tour at some point. This is her new bedroom. Isn't it gorgeous? She like has the master suite up in the attic. And I use this because I don't want to make a roof. I actually use this to roof over the house. So, yeah. Then I put paper up for the bedroom walls. This is the bathroom and that's their pet cat. And they have a lot of pet dogs, like pet golden retrievers. So yeah, now I'm going to go ahead and organize the room up a little bit. So the bed is made, and I did got to show you something that I found on their bathing suits. So this is the Reborn Girl swimsuits, and I did not put, I actually got this last year, like before summer. And guess what, I did not get a chance to put this on Catherine yet, but good thing there's an indoor pool and I can... Go into an indoor pool and put this on. Or look how tiny this swimsuit I found at Walmart is. Isn't it so cute? This is the swimsuit. It's by Wonder Wonder Nation. So this is her swimsuit. Love the bottoms. This is definitely gonna fit my newborn baby Catherine. And then it came with this little bow, so Catherine may also wear this on her head. I think that's so cute. She's definitely gonna have to wear this swimsuit. This um swimsuit I got from Walmart. So now I'm gonna go put it in in here, back in their bathing suits, um and stuff. I actually got um Abby swimming suit from Walmart, and then I also got um Naomi swimsuit from Walmart. She has a swimsuit from. Naomi also has a swimsuit from Target. I don't do much shopping, um, but I actually bought all of Natalie's clothes at Target. I would like to make it to Target for Natalie to get her a Halloween shirt, so make sure you stay tuned for a Halloween haul. I would like to do that, and I did get some new Halloween soap, so if you didn't check out Bath & Body Works in the mall video, um, make sure you check that out, because I got Bath & Body Works, and I got some fall scented because it is uh, fall, so got to get fall. Um, and I love the fall smell. I actually used some of the Bath and Body Works this, um, this, um, last time. I am going to save some for Halloween and Thanksgiving and fall. So I just have to try not to use it. And see, her clothes are by Cat and Jack, 18 months. Some people don't care to show their kids clothes, but I don't mind showing uh, my baby doll's clothes. Some people just like to get clothes to, you know, be unique and stuff. It's to be unique in their own way, but they're actually not selling these anymore because we got them last year on sale. Right, Natalie? She's like, I don't care. I don't care what I'm wearing. Then I got these little shorts as well from Target um, um, for Natalie. And her, even the diaper she's wearing, it's a generic brand from Target. So, I got that. She's, she's still potty training. I love you, Natalie. You're so cute. You're so cute. Natalie, you too, Abby. Abby just fell over. Okay. Yeah. Are you girls going to play? Do you guys want a toy? I got Natalie's baby rattle toy from Target. Um, I do like to go to Target. I like to go to Kohl's. I like to go to each store, even mall, the mall. Because I just like the brands of clothing for me and my dolls and all that. So, yeah, I just buy their clothes from there. And I also buy off Amazon, so pretty much a lot of stores. So, yeah. Pull-ups. So, I'm going to move Charlie out of here. Diapers. Um, I need to make sure I be, I always forget. I need to pack this pull-up for when Noah's going somewhere or bring one with me. Because um, Noah is not potty trained. And I'm, I'm starting to potty train him. And he fits this size. And I do get confused with Liam because Liam... It's um, a different size pull-up, 
So Liam is doing pull-ups. Um, he is going to wear good nights at night once I get him um, these because he has to wear pull-ups during the day is because he's not potty trained at all and it takes so long for it seems like for for the boys to, to not be potty trained um the girls i am actually still potty training so yeah so this is um Lee, liam's little pull up and his is like mcqueen and he is still wearing cars he just likes wearing mcqueen and then i have this from a toddler i used to have but i sold my toddler doll um i forgot his name oh his name was michael and i um sold him and he was one of my toddler dolls he had like long brown hair like curl is it was like medium short curly brown hair he was one of my toddlers and he fitted these he was actually from i forgot what um reborn he was called but he was from these and these are old pull-ups and i had a toddler again when i was a practically a young child and these were theirs so these were his so i had him for a long time but i sold him because he was just i was starting to run out of space and i just gave him to someone else i donated him to someone else and now he is not in, in my life anymore but i do use these for lamb now Liam is still wearing White McQueen and he loves Mater and he just loves the designs and the easy open tab so he can crawl. So these are Liam's and this Liam fits different like gigantic size. This is literally the size he wears. Like Liam, he's so huge. This is size 4T to 5T. So he fits 4T to 3T to 4T and he fits 4T to 5T. So He's a big toddler that I got, and I opened up. So, yeah, that is that. And we were also in an apartment, and when I was in the house, um, the old house, I had a toddler, and we had to move into an apartment, so that was kind of getting out of room, so I had to sell my dolls and donate some of my dolls. So, that was a big, sad transition until we moved into a bigger house and a bigger room, and now I can throw all my stuff in it. So yeah, now swim diapers. I need to actually give these to the daycare next summer for when I'm going when I'm having the babysit. So and preschool because they do have like water days where they play in the kiddie pool and they play in the sprinkler. And I also will have to bring these to the pool because Liam now yeah, Liam does wear bigger sizes because he is a chunker and he was a toddler, so he fits his size. Then, again, again, um, let's see, again, I do need to organize my swimming pool bag because the babies are really small. Um, I do have stuff for my waterproof babies and just stuff I can just play with with in the pool at any time because I do bring Barbies out and I do bring other dolls out. This is my pool set. So this I have diving sticks. And am I missing one? No, I'm not missing one. I have four different diving sticks and I have pool floaty toys like pool toys and I have a big pool floaty that I bring to the indoor pool that I pack in here and then I have swim goggles and I have just goggles in general this is like for the for the boys swim goggles I can also put them on Charlie when I'm dressing to bring them to the pool but I think I'm gonna put these on Noah and they actually probably will fit Liam better so we'll figure that out and now I'm going to put this ball, I got crazy pins, and it's waterproof, and it floats in the water, so I'm going to put that in there. So now I'm going to set this right here, and these in, in here, just for extra, and we go swimming, because we do go swimming a lot. And I got to remember, I need to bring this to Noah's daycare, because, um, 
And now, day, Noah is um, at daycare. He fits this size, 2D 3T, because I just put on pull-ups, and it's probably going to take him forever to be potty trained, but that's okay. I just have to remember to bring this to um, daycare when I'm packing his bag. Okay, so now I'm going to change Lily into some in, into a new short shirt and a new shorts and new shorts. So I'm so excited. And I do gotta tell you. Let me get you this light. I do gotta tell you that um, we are going to a hotel for my birthday. It's not Washington D.C. But it is the Great Wolf Lodge, and, and we're staying at a hotel. And um, it's they do they have so much stuff. It's two hundred something dollars a night. So we gotta save for my birthday. Then we're staying in a hotel for my cousin's wedding, and I gotta figure out who I'm bringing. I know I'm gonna bring some Barbies on the vacation, and I am going to bring one of the Reborns. So. I am gonna do that. I'm probably gonna look for a suitcase for the Barbies. Um, today, because today is Friday, and I am going to um look for that. And I am gonna start decorating for Halloween today. I need to start getting looking at the Halloween decorations. So. What you could see Lena over there. Here. There you go. So I'm gonna get William dressed and ready for the day. And I need to get some socks and shoes on him because we're going outside to just hang out and just play and he can play with some of his outdoor toys and stuff. It's really hard to see him because of the light. He's dressed. You'll see his outfit. I just think today is a perfect day just to go outside. It's cool. It's supposed to be 66 degrees today. That's so perfect for fall weather. I'm just putting him in longer, sh longer shorts. So... Just in case it does get a little cool, I can wear some shorts and a t-shirt. And we are going home shopping, so yeah, I'm excited. Tomorrow we're going to Dollar Tree and we're going out to eat. Now I'm going to get a little sneaky buddy so we can get take off your shirt and put a new shirt on you. That light. The sunlight's coming in through the window. And I am looking for Liam a hairbrush at Dollar Tree, by the way. So, I'm going to do that. And I need to get some hairspray for his hair to um, wet it down and make his hair even. So, yeah. I would like to make his hair even so I can brush it and make it, his bangs even and his sides even so I would like to do that his head's kind of turned that way here I guess there we go and now I can put this shirt down
I got this t-shirt at a mall with one of my aunts. Um, and I like the Nike shirt, you can see it. And he's wearing his Nike shoes and everything. And he's wearing his little socks with his tennis shoes. So cute. Alright, buddy, are you ready to go outside and play? Yeah. Now he's gonna go outside and play. Now I'm in the garage, and this is where we keep the 4th of July. Um, and I do want to get more of these bins, but they're just so expensive at Walmart. They're like $19, $20. And of course I want to save um, money. And I got 4th of July flags, so I keep the 4th of July, St. Patrick's Day, and Valentine's stuff in here. So, I keep all that. And there is our spider, our spider decoration for Halloween. And there's more. There's like a, a tablecloth down there for Halloween, for our Halloween party, and an owl, so. And there's, of course, spiderwebs all over the place, because I have some spiderweb things, and we can put them on their bushes, but my dad's gonna look trashy, so we put it inside and make it look like a haunted house. So now, I'm gonna go hang us up on the front door, and I do gotta show you something cool, and I will get come back and get Liam some toys. If he's even still there. It's a cold day, buddy. Oh my gosh. He crawled all the way up there. That is a spider. It's big, too. That's scary. He crawled all the way up there. Okay, so now we're going to... I could have just gone inside and done it, but I guess I didn't want to. This even glows in the dark, if you guys can see. See the lighting in there? I got this from Dollar Tree, and now I'm going to go buy some more Dollar Tree Halloween decorations. So, yeah. I love the little web, the little spider. It's a tarantula. And I guess we have another Halloween spider up there. He's doing a good job decorating the home, I guess. What is creepy? It's scary too. Look, he even made those webs. I told Daddy it's coming down after Halloween. I feel like I'm being a strict mom. So I don't want um, a spider hanging up on our house. Because it looks venomous, even though I don't think so. But still. So. I heard its bites are as powerful as a bumblebee sting, so definitely don't want to find out. Clean up the garage as much as we can. We got some more things that need to throw away. Just some itty bitty scraps that need to be thrown away. And Liam, I, I know you guys are like wondering why is your poison sitting right next to him? Is well because it's just the way he sat it. I'm probably gonna move it out of the way. Because we don't need it anymore. It's going to be... It's fall now. So we're not going to need poison until next year for the weeds. So this is actually, well, this came from the mail. And I'm going to go ahead and... Here, I'll just move this out of the way. Over here. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to get the mail because there is mail that needs to be given to Daddy. So we have mail and now we're going to go give it to my dad. So let's be nice and helpful. Here's the mail for you. Oh, thank you. What does it mean here? 